In this video, I am going to show you how to power the light meter on the Super 8 camera using alternative battery sources. The first step is to open the light meter's battery compartment. Now the light meter requires two 625 type batteries, but unfortunately I couldn't get a hold of those. Why search from store to store looking for a 625 type battery while well, you can find another alternative? The first step is to grab two 357 type button cell batteries and the rolled up strip of paper that is about the same height as the two batteries stacked together. The last step is to place a piece of aluminum foil where it can make contact with the two batteries. However, this is just one way to power the light meter. I have another alternative that is a little bit simpler. For this next alternative, you will need a CR1632 lithium 3 volt battery and several pieces of aluminum foil or other kind of metal that can fit inside the battery compartment nice and snug. Now it's time to close up the battery compartment. I tested both battery sources to see if they were working fine. I tested to see if the light meter was working good, and sure enough it was working perfectly as I expected. Now the camera doesn't really do a good job of taking video of this viewfinder, but as you can see the needle that indicates the aperture of the camera changes whenever the amount of light coming to the camera changes as well. And that's how I hacked a Super 8 camera's light meter. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, have a nice day.